All right, this is me. That is a purple bike. And that is Eastern Illinois University. We're gonna see if we can't make a video while I'm riding a purple bike through Eastern Illinois University. All right, man, let's get this puppy on the road, shall we? All right, first off, Min is gone, it's official, and it fucking sucks, but Min, I wish you the best of luck with your nursing school, and, you know, just fucking right on, man, best of luck. Of course, your hair looks fucking styling. Everybody knows that. Everyone knows Min has just phenomenal fucking hair. And it sucks to see you go. Everybody loves Min. Everybody. But, you know, you got to do what you got to do. So just do it and have fun, buddy. Hope to see you around, Min. Peace out, yeah? All right. Ted, in his video, asked, like, how often do we go party and shit like that, you know? And I'm going to be honest. I used to go out and party a lot, like a lot, a lot. I have what some doctors like to call an addictive personality. Woohoo! But uh, not so much, you know? Not so much anymore. I kind of just go out drinking. Usually... It is during UFC events, you know, when I got my big MMA fights, I will drink uh, beer, fine malt liquor, hard liquor. Uh, you know, it's good times. Oh man, if this is a windy video, I'm sorry guys, because hell, I'm riding a bike. And, oh. No handlebar style, baby. I'm just fucking, you know, doing it like a big boss. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, shit. Okay, easy, easy. All right, yeah, I don't know. This video might be utter trash, but let's see. We got goodbye to men. Fucking boozing. Yeah, I used to be a real big party animal. Like, I was that guy. I am the king of the beer bong, you know? Not beer pong. I fucking suck at beer pong. I've never been good, I'm never gonna be good, and I don't care if I fucking suck. But I am the champion at the beer bong, like that's easy. I can drink shit fast, no problem. But uh, oh shit son! Whew, I ain't that skilled on the purple bike. But, yeah, what else? Keg stands? No sir. I don't do keg stands. What the fuck, huh? Huh? Didn't this guy right there, didn't he get the memo? Did he not get the memo that I was gonna be fucking making a video, ride the purple bike through Eastern Illinois University? What the shit, man, honestly. What the shit? What's that guy's problem? I don't like it. He can go fuck himself. All right, with that out of the way, yeah, big party guy, you know? Beer bong, for the win, I kick fucking ass. Beer pong, I suck. Keg stands, I tried one keg stand, and my, my little T-Rex arms could not support my body weight, and I ended up falling on the keg, and I knocked the whole keg over, and ice went everywhere, and I broke the tap off the son of a bitch. So, that was like my first and only attempt at a keg stand. Yeah. There's some things in life you know you can't do, right? But, but. All right, now we're going to talk about Ryan. And he brought up, like, telling stories and shit. Ryan, you got some skill, man. You got some skill. And I think it's probably just because of your voice. Like, I love your accent. I totally do. I can listen to you just read the ingredients off a dog food bag. You know, it's fucking amazing. And, yeah, but I'm going to finish up here and go to my house because I have books I would like to show. And apparently we're showing shit off because Greg showed off a bunch of shit. Like, pretty much everything 
Greg showed off is for the win, including Antique Bakery. I'm going to have to fucking Netflix that shit like a son of a bitch. Because Antique Bakery, it looked pretty cool, man. Okay, okay, this video shall pick up when we get back to my house and I have books to show. All right. All right, two books that I love looked a little something like this. All right, the first one is Gracie Submission Essentials, and it's about Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. That is a grappling art. It's not a kick-and-punch type martial art. It deals with taking people to the ground and applying a joint lock or a chokehold. And in this book, they talk about chokeholds being more efficient because if you are a big, tough guy... You can break your arm and keep fighting, but you can't keep fighting if you're passed out. I don't care how big and tough you are. That's a good book right there. Now, this has to be my all-time favorite book that I've gotten, Christmas present, birthday, it don't matter. This book is amazing. It's just packed with pictures, extremely informational, and it's tiny. Like, look at that. Big book, little book. And uh, if you like the sushis, I would highly suggest checking out this book right here. It's good stuff. And both of these books are packed full of pictures, so that doesn't hurt the cause at all. But, yep, yeah, all right, there you go. Gracie Submission Essentials and Samurai Sushi for the win.